Charles has made his first public appearance since his cancer diagnosis and his son Prince Harry has arrived in the UK to visit the 75 year old monarch. Ian Lee reports from Buckingham Palace. Prince Harry has arrived in London to visit his father following news of King Charles' cancer diagnosis. This is the first real time he's spent any meaningful face-to-face -face time with his father in 18 months. The health revelation came just a week after King Charles left the hospital following treatment for a benign enlarged prostate. It was then that doctors discovered what Buckingham Palace describes as a separate issue of concern, although the palace won't say what type of cancer the king has. The palace said in a statement, the 75-year-old monarch's doctors have advised him to postpone public events but that he will continue with his official duties. The king is someone who is usually in very robust health. When I worked with him, it was terrifically hard to keep up with him. CBS News royal contributor Julian Payne is the king's former communication secretary. This will be something he's not used to. I think he will be stoic about it. I think he will do what the doctors are asking him to do. Many here in London are hoping the king's cancer battle leads to a reconciliation between the Duke of Sussex and the royal family. This whole family feud fit things seems a bit silly in my opinion, as you'll make up and hopefully this brings them together a little bit more. He's got to come back to see his father, hasn't he? I mean, it's the right thing to do. Prince Harry is no longer a working royal, so he's not expected to take up royal duties. The public face of the monarchy falls to the heir to the throne, Prince William, returning to full-time duty himself after caring for his wife, the Princess of Wales, after she underwent abdominal surgery last month. Ian Lee, CBS News, London.